This week, starting Monday, February 26, 2018, Brunswick News ran a major story called For the Love of New Brunswick, a story about a business group based out of Moncton generating a series of videos and doing some research on the impact of buying local. The question emerges, though, is that they made no mention of all the other buy local campaigns that exist in the province. Quite often, consumers and general public will complain that they're inundated with too many messages and they can't make sense for all of the noise that it creates. For example, Bathurst last year came up with their own buy local campaign and they offered discounts. The artisans and artists of the province have a website called Created Here, and they also have a magazine to support this. The Conservation Council of New Brunswick for a long time have had a Buy Local NB website Facebook page, which has over 8,000 followers. The provincial government, of course, has their Buy New Brunswick initiative that even includes a social media toolkit, and that campaign has been around for a long time. A few years ago, the Farmers Union in New Brunswick offered up this piece of information and tried to promote it as much as they could. If every household allocated $13 a week to buying local produce and groceries, it would have an impact of $100 million for the local farmers and local economy. So when we look at the story this week in the news about buy local, it's nothing new. So the question emerges, what will this add to a change in our action? Maybe the change should be that we start working together, cooperating, unifying the message, creating a single campaign for 750,000 people that it encourages to take care of ourselves as a community. (laughs) 